Hey y'all, this is Miss Mother Trucker and welcome to my channel. I am sitting here in uh, Tracy, California. I got to get a load restacked. I arrived at my um, shipper, or I mean my receiver, and they left everything. Well, they took off probably half the load, maybe quarter. Now I'm saying about a quarter of the load. And, um, I mean, they were just ramming us, ramming us. I mean, I felt like a Bangkok hooker just being hit hard. So, right? So, anyway, um, we turned around and, uh, I pull up to leave and I'm, I look in the back and it's, it's half full. And I mean, so I look at the, you pull up to the gate, they give you your bills, and I say, what's going on? It's still half on. The light went green. I moved. They said to move when the light goes green, so, and head to the gate to get your bills. So they go, well, they said, um, let me see what it said to be more precise. Okay. I'll tell you exactly what the deal said. It said comments, load is being refused due to uh, cases sliding off pallets. Looks like multiple pallets upon arrival. All has been verified by manager. Now, this is what it looks like, guys. And you tell me if it looks like anything. Right? That's what I said. I was like, excuse me? I am not thinking so. So, anyway. And I sent, of course, it into claims and everything. You know, pictures are worth a thousand words. Sent it into claims and said, you know, this is what's going on. But, I am going ahead. I'm coming. I'm at the place here in Tracy that, uh, well, near Tracy that reworks these loads. And I'm just like, you've got to be kidding. But, you know, you got to be able to roll with the punches in this game. It is what it is. And, you know, you got to go forward. Oh, by the way, I tried these little uh, curler things. They're like these little uh, long tubes that you twist and then you do up. Because, you know, on the truck, it's, it's really hard to break out hot rollers or a curling iron, you know, to do something different with my hair. What do y'all think? You guys like it? Don't like it? What? Anyway, I had to try something new. Because Eric kept saying, do something with your hair. Do something with your hair. Well, I'm not cutting my hair off. I'm sorry. It does need to be trimmed, though. But anyway, um, squirrel, right? So, that's what happened. And I'm waiting for them to call and give me a door to back into. And um, where I can get this load reworked. Then I got to get back over to the receiver. And I'm not going to state the receiver. Um, because they are prime customers, and I'm not going to call out prime customers. I don't believe in that. Um, and then I'm going to get back over there. Hopefully, they get me downloaded. I know I keep messing with it, y'all. It's like looking in a mirror when I'm doing it. How sad, right? But anyway, guys, um, other than that, everything's going good. I do got a pre-plan going to Montana. Which, oh my gosh, if I'm able to do it, if they get this downloaded in time, it'll be awesome. Because the pre-plan is, uh, I think, like 900 miles for 3,400. But it is going into Billings, which means that going out, you're going to deadhead about 500 miles. And that totally sucks. But it is what it is. It's all part of trucking. You know, I do so enjoy trucking. I absolutely love it. Um, I don't know how much longer I'll stay as a full-time trucker. You know, it's hard to picture doing something else now. But I do have something else in mind already. Um, I was going to be going to RB Tech Skills paid for. And I think I will, if I do leave, I'll probably leave in November. Um, and uh, go into RV Tech School if I do. And then I will truck part time is, uh, for truck movers and then do RV Tech work over the winter there in Quartzsite. 
because, you know, you make it around low-end, $125 an hour, high-end, you know, 160 bucks an hour. And so I'll probably be going for around 140 bucks an hour uh, doing mobile RV tech work for myself there in Quartzsite, you know. And I should stay really, really busy with those winter months. And then the rest of the year do RV, uh, not RV, but um, truck deliveries. So, you know, so I'll still be trucking. You know, my life will just be changing a little. So those are some of the things we're looking at in the future that's coming up. Um, I hope everyone's doing well. You guys stay safe. Keep the rubber on the road. Keep the shiny side up. And until next time, Mother Trucker out.